my experience. Excellent. So yes. Well, it requires a lot of practice to do what Dennis Burrell can do. It also requires practice if you were playing in the Torrance Symphony. Let's take a look at their recent fundraiser. Torrance Symphony supporters enjoyed a night of beautiful music, food, and prizes. It was a musical night with musical people all in the name of fun and fundraising. For many of the supporters, music has always held a special role in their lives. It's part of our community education and it elevates us. It, remember, it reminds us who we are, where we came from, where we should be going. Supporters couldn't wait to see what the band had in store for them. Oh, I love live music. It's just so uh, invigorating. I, I, I mean, I listen to the recorded music, but whenever I'm in a, in a theater or a concert hall or whatever, it's just the, uh, the energy it's, and, and, and seeing everybody and it's, yeah, it's just invigorating. Before the performance, guests were able to bid on silent auction items, including a hat decorated with $100. Maestro David Stanton and the Palos Verdes Orchestra were the featured performers. It's a good opportunity for the band. It's a good opportunity for the Torrance Symphony audience, you know, to hear another group and for us to support the Torrance Symphony in that way. The evening featured two solo performances. and it was capped off with a montage of hit songs by the Beatles. <laughs> Torrance Symphony President Michael Krauss hopes the orchestra helps to pave the way for future musicians. Music is everything, to me anyway. Uh, I think you have the uh, schools that are cutting back on their music programs and everybody is hurting. Seventh grader Craig Jinquin comes to events like this and dreams of what he can do one day. I'd like to perform in a symphonic band like this one and maybe even a philharmonic if I can get that, if I can get that far. The final concert will be on June 16th. For Spotlight Torrance, I'm Jay-Z Jeans. The Torrance Symphony was established in 1985. Its mission is to enhance the community's cultural growth by promoting the appreciation of music through concerts, educational programs, and opportunities for emerging artists. Their concerts are highly anticipated by the South Bay and are given throughout the year. For more information, call 310-373-2442 or visit torrensymphony.org. Five, four.